With less than a week to go until the first game, the Ayn Rand Football League held their first inaugural draft on Friday on a conference call broadcast live at Ragin' Cajun headquarters. With four teams keeping their entire roster, five of the drafting squads conferenced to select their players. Ending weeks of suspense and speculation, the Circling Dogs utilized their first pick to take Adrian Peterson. Peterson, entering his second season with the Minnesota Vikings, finished behind only Ladainley and Tomlinson for rushing yards last year. The Dogs are betting that Adrian's knee ligament injury from November won't impair his season and he'll continue to be a solid performer throughout 2008. With the first pick made, the draft process soon descended into chaos. Isn't Marion Barber a girl? Who the hell's Aaron James? You only choose white quarterbacks. Plaxico Burgess. That's a good name for the baby. And Tony Roma's gay. Oh, that's annoying. Make that stop. And it wasn't long before league managers and the assistant coaches were trading insults. Oh, who, who's my who's my third string punter? I don't even know who that guy is. You think as a commissioner you understand how to use your power? Oh, you bastard! His wife Catherine knows more about football than he does, so it helps. I'm only ten years old. You illegitimate child. Wow. I, I enjoy a good head. Yes, there were several very uncomfortable moments. And although several league managers expressed concerns that the draft would be repetitious and boring, Commissioner Don Wedding assured everyone that the event would be filled with laughs and fun. Now, Mike, remember, punters. Punters, get, grab yourself about three of them. And remember, Daniel, I'm your brother, I wouldn't lie to you. Punters. You want a punter? Punters! 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 punters. The trick at this point in the game is grab punters. Go send your dad out for some, some food and then just start drafting punters for him, okay? Uh, that joke is funnier every time you say it. Thanks to one frisky manager, adult beverages have been banned from future league events. There's no white guys at the top of the list. What the heck? <laughs> He's not wearing pants. The entire league was stunned and embarrassed as her behavior became more erratic. Can I come over just for like three weeks or so? I love you. Eventually, her husband explained the source of their marital problems. She's a woman who doesn't know anything about football. He tearfully confided that she was having an extramarital affair. She's getting charge our banks. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Did I mention there were some uncomfortable moments? Thankfully, one of the assistant coaches led her from the team headquarters back to the hotel. Yeah, I'm Bye-bye. And so ended the inaugural year of the Ayn Rand draft, a sad lesson in frailty and human weakness.